Tim Ice Harris, head football coach at Dade All Stars here at Moore Park. It's been tough, cause, you know, you only have three days to actually prepare for a game of this magnitude. But to make it easy, I think the high school coaches around Dade County did a terrific job in terms of their development of their student athletes. And for us to be able to put them together, you know, in these three days, we feel like we put ourselves in position to be able to have a good set, a good showing come Saturday night at Trash Pile. Well, it's definitely exciting for me. You know, I'm so happy as a coach to have an opportunity to be able to be in this position, to be able to coach all these tremendous uh, student athletes here in Dade County. You know, and, uh, and for me, I mean, it's just a big honor. You know, watch these kids, you know, at, at other, you know, when you're going scouting, playing against them, and, and, and then being able to, to put this thing together in this, in this short period of time. You know, I've been so excited this whole week, you know, and I'm very excited looking forward to Saturday night, watching them all really come together and build a great relationship for lifetime you know it's great you know coach uh ice harris the head coach for uh, booker t does a great job you know i'm out here i'm learning some stuff you know as a young head coach i get to learn from a great experienced head coach and um you know there's a lot of talent out here a lot of good guys and it's, it's, it's pretty good experience to work with them and you know all the different personalities it's a lot of fun it's not all about pointers we're just having fun and you know just talking some football Keem's a great kid great spirit uh, you know, I, I know that Carroll City loved him. He did an outstanding job, and even out here, his his work ethic. Uh, both, you know, the other quarterbacks, quarterback from Crop and uh, Troy Cook from Southridge, doing great jobs. So it's just a lot of fun, and it's a great experience. Darius is special. You know, he's a good kid on and off the field. You know, comes from a great background, great family. I had the pleasure to work with him, and I was blessed to work with him. And I'm glad he's part of my life, and he will be for a long time. The offensive coordinator, uh, you know, uh, Coach Harris and his son, they're calling the plays, and you know, they're doing a great job. And I'm just learning from them. I could have probably borrowed about 60 points a game from them this year and been successful so I'm just having a good time and I'm excited you know it's a great atmosphere my defensive coordinator coach Campbell's out here as well so it's just a great great time with the coaches and just you know coming together and bonding it's been a good experience and everything like that you have the chance to work with um, some guys from other schools and stuff like that and they're very talented and you know I knew a couple of them from the area like William French from Carroll City and to be to be able to work with them hands-on and see the talented ability to work out here on the field and stuff like that you know it's great pleasure to be out here so it's been a fun experience and I just can't wait till the showtime on Saturday night. I think all of them as a group as a core have been you know making their plays and stuff like that and I'm I'm really um, big on as far as like Vince Hall I think he's been stepping up because he's like a undersized guy under the radar type of guy right he's kind of short and stuff like that but you know he, he plays big he got a big heart and he made good plays out here and you know so I'm very impressed with his game and stuff like that and I look forward to seeing him transition in that game as far as Saturday. It's an honor it's great you know you know to, to be able to have one as a player and then to to be, be able to have one as a coach, you know, I'm, uh, you know, I'm very blessed to be in this situation right here. It's been good, up tempo, a lot of reps, a lot of stuff to learn, learning process, a chance to get a, get to know a couple of guys, from different teams, feel good. It's a privilege. It's a privilege. It's, it's an honor, you know. Give it all to God. You just be there to see. Now these are some of my guys. These are offensive linemen here. I'm taking a knee with them because this this how we rest when we're not out there. Just talk to them and talk about how practice has been for you guys. Just how fun it's been being out with everybody. Uh, it's really been fun. Really, uh, you know, getting to uh, play with you know like practice with people you know who you played against and stuff like that. And uh, just great competition. Now, Jordan, how's been the line been? Like, I mean, there's a lot of talented guys out here. What talk about just the man for man, just the talent on this offensive line out here? It's it's insane. You know, everyone can hold their ground, and uh, you know we, we've been doing a good job. It's a different blocking scheme for a couple of us, but we, we picked it up, and it's looking good. Should should be should be a good game Saturday. Now, I, a couple of people were saying that the Florida team's defensive line is supposed to be pretty good. Now. I would have taken that personally. I want to get a couple pancakes in this one. Is that that is that the plan for Saturday night? Uh, yeah. <laughs> you are you already know that's the plan. That's every offensive line plan and stuff like that is go out there and dominate and just finish. That's all. So what's some of the things you picked up this week being around such great coaches, other great players? What have you picked up that you can incorporate for this game and moving forward as you go to the next level, Jordan? Well, the tempo for sure. We were practicing at a college pace. It's been it's been high t high tempo, really fast, and ju just learn a lot of little things, just uh, just some little things just to put them into my game and get better. All right, you're ready at first. This is where football games are won in the trenches with the big guys like this. Practice has been good. You know, it's a honor to work with a couple of these boys out here. Everybody really, you know, I ain't never you know rate with this much talent. So it's a blessing to be out here with all this great talent. We had to come together fast. It just showed me how much talent it is in Florida, Dade County, all that. So I just just work hard with them boys and just. Stay focused, you know, and just get this victory when we go out there. There's a lot of pride because 
at the end of the day, you know, this Dade County, you know, this, this, this our backyard this is where we from. So, you know, we got to take over so that we still the best. It's just an honor to be, you know, just run behind our old line and receivers, everybody. Uh, I already got no prediction, you know what I mean? We just, we just, I, would, I just want y'all to come out there and see.